Hello. Hi, I'm Nikki. I'm the chairman of the Fordingbridge Players. I joined the Players probably about 12 years ago, something like that, um, and was thrown in the deep end playing a part in uh, Pink String and Sealing Wax. And from there, I've kind of developed, I became the secretary, and somehow I've ended up being the chairman as well. So it's a very small group. Uh, there's only about 25 of us at the moment, which is why we're doing this video, to try and attract some of you to come and join us and, and join in the fun with us. So there's the sound and light part of it, the technicians. This is a very challenging role and it's something that anybody can have a go at. We've got lots of professionals that can help you learn the skills that you need. And it's all sorts of things. So lighting may be very, very simple for some plays, but very elaborate for others. The sound, again, we may have very simple sound effects and then we may have others where we've got trains and cars and whistles and birds singing. We also get the opportunity as well when you're doing that side of it is on some of the plays we have to have special effects such as smoke um, and we've even had pyrotechnics as well. So it's a great area to get into, especially if you're technically minded and you're into that, that kind of thing. Stage crew. This is a very exciting area. This is one that is crucial to all of us because if we didn't have the people backstage then the actors wouldn't really know what they were doing. One of the key parts of backstage is being the stage manager. This is the one that when we're actually performing the play, they are in charge and what they say goes. They have communication with the technical team and they're there to basically push us on when we need to be pushed on, make sure that the props are being given to us at the right times, dragging us off again um, and working out you know, when to pull the curtains, house lights and that sort of thing. Also the backstage, we have the team, just the basic team that are there to help us, help us change our costumes if we need to change, to help us um, with our props, um, and also guiding us, making sure that our scripts are where we need them when we come running off stage in a panic. Another crucial part is the prompt. The prompt is one of those roles where hopefully we will never use them on the show nights, but they're there as a, as a comfort blanket, if you like, so that if we get really, really stuck, the prompt's there to help us out. So a crucial, crucial role that is something that is quite special, you have to be very focused and, and concentrate, but it's still an absolute fundamental part of what we do. We also have the props team. The props team are there, as, as it simply says, to sort out the props. They have a table and they have to follow the script to make sure that they give us the cup and saucer when we need it or the sword or, or whatever it happens to be. So backstage is a really exciting area with lots of different functions. Um, pulling curtains as well, you mustn't forget that, rather crucial. You need to have strong arms for that one. Then we've got set building. Now this is one of my passions. I do acting, but set building is my real love. This is something where you're basically making something out of nothing. The more complicated the set, the more I love doing it. And we've got a great team of people that do that. You have to be a bit of a DIYer. I will go to people and sort of like say, okay, I need a landslide, or I need a kitchen sink, or I need a great big stone fireplace. And it's how do we achieve that using the materials that we have available to us. We do quite a lot of the work in advance of the play. So in people's garages and stuff, we'll be building benches and log burners and various things. And then we have a set build weekend, which is normally the weekend before the production starts. And this is where we bring all the things together. We put up the flats and we do a load of painting and decorating, putting up curtains and then all the dressing the sets. So bringing in all those little finer details, the clocks and the pictures and, and all these various things fascinating thing to do absolutely love it and if, if you're DIY minded I'd strongly encourage you to come and have a go with us front of house when we put on a play we always like to provide our audience with a drink and some nibbles and they seem to quite enjoy that so front of house is crucial they have to arrange everything from the glasses to the washing up to getting in the wine and the nibbles and the soft drinks and all the rest of it so lovely people face to face with all the audience um, and thoroughly enjoy what they do and hopefully everybody enjoys having a drink. The Fordingbridge Players has been going for many many years, I think over 40 years but way before my time anyway and over those years we've had many players, many members that have come and gone, all of which have taken a great deal out of being part of us whether they've been actors or doing some of the other roles that I've already talked about. So if you think that it might be something that would interest you, then please you know, get in touch and come and have a chat with us. You don't have to have any experience. The only thing I'd done was being a munchkin in The Wizard of Oz when I was about nine years old, and look at me now. So anybody can do it. So you're more than welcome. We would love to see you. So please do get in touch with us.